Okay, hello everyone, welcome to this channel. On this video, I'm going to show you how to reverse a cell, a digit in cell, or alphabet, or letters in cell, uh, to the reverse one. It's quite complex, uh, it's not easy to explain for me, to be honest. Uh, but I will show you how to practice it, how to do this one Google using Google Sheet. Here I have the one cell, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, till nine, and I can reverse it to nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I will explain it uh, divided into several steps, a few steps. Then I will uh, combine it into one cell uh, function or one cell formula. Here, for example, I want to change it to A, B, C, D, E. Here already, already reverse it A B C D E to E D C B A, but it still have an error that for E on the last one, but no problem. Here how to do it? First, you input the cell you want to reverse, and then you do mid, which means middle function, the reference cell, the string the A1 cell and then the length of the A1 cell which means it will address to the last digits of your cell but deduct to 1 which means it will return the string uh, starting from the this E E digits or the last digit and how many uh, how many digits you want to extract is 1 okay but you have to notice that here I deduct to C1 which means to boundary the, the maximum of digits so I will show you the C1 functions the C1 function is the sequence function the sequence will return a number from 1 2 3 4 or 2 through 4 5 in the sequence number so I put the sequence length of A1 which means I will return rows how many digits that a one has and then the column of course one i want i want to return one column only and then starts from zero which means to the b1 column here minus c1 or deduct to c1 is minus zero which means will be returns the last digits of this cell okay i i back to the sequence this one is automatically uh, array to expand to the bottom, uh, expand to uh, to the next row because this one is sequence formula or array formula. Let's see if I delete it, it will still return to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. And then mid A1, blah, 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 just to drag and the variable of uh, change variable should be the C column. Here, as you can see, minus 1, which means the second last, and then minus 3, which means the third last, and then minus 3, uh, which means the fourth last, and the last one, the minus C5 means the fifth last, the fifth last. And then the, uh, the final function is, you put on D1, is concatenate the B1 until B5 or B something. Now I have the EDCBA. Now, how to return it uh, using only one function, or I mean only one cell formula, no need to divide like this. You can do it using the array formula function. This is the key. I just combine it reversely from the concatenate and then the sequence and then the middle function. Here, the array formula, if you already know about it, already familiar, maybe you you will you you're not, you will easy to use to practice this function here are a formula and then meet and then same like before the a12 because i move to the a12 cell and then the length the length of this cell and then here the sequence function which will returns an array data or, or an array result as you can see, I I put I put this function into replacing this C1 function, but I put the array formula 
on the beginning. After that, I just concatenate all of them, so it will return the reverse of A12 cell. For example, I will change for uh, Trump president. It will return like this automatically. Okay, I know it's not easy for you. You just just follow the my instruction step by step. I will put the function on the description below. Or if you have any question regarding this, please put on the comment below. Or regarding any of Google Sheet uh, problems, you can ask me because I'm an expert of this. And then, uh, oh yeah, this function is very very easy. Uh, uh, it's uh, the if you googling on Stack Overflow, they use the the macro or the the complex function. But my one is very simple function using basic function. But you have to understand it fully, understand it to make to use it on the further analytics. Okay, I hope it's useful for you. If you have any question, please put on the comment below. And if you like, please subscribe our channel. Thank you. Bye. Oh, the last one I want I want I want to show you the the other formation. For example, I like Cristiano Ronaldo, and and I will drag it to the bottom. And oops, here already absolute. So I change to a thirteen a thirteen. Now it reverse Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay, that's it.